Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today's the day. We're off to Wembley, and I've just woke up. It is 9.25. I'm using my flashlight as a light. I'm using, it's 9.25 in the morning. I need to go and get a bath, and then Mr. Freddy, you know, is picking us up, and we're off to the train station. I hope you enjoy the vlog. If you do, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Just enjoy. We've had a bath. Oh, that's so there's a cough copyright. Jesus. We've had a bath, so I don't smell. Looking f hot as f I'm on the way to London. The t-shirt that I'm going to be wearing. Unbelievable t-shirt. Pat, bloody butcher. She is a phenomenal lady. 20 quid off Amazon. Best thing I've ever bought. Right, we're dressed. Got the United hoodie on. We're just waiting for Freddie to pick us up. And then have a guess where we're going. I'll, I'll give you five seconds to have a guess where we're going. Five. One. McDonald's breakfast, baby. Let's f Get it. We are here at McDonald's breakfast. Mr. Fredinho is there. How are we, Freddie? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Looking forward to the weekend. Oh, am I looking forward to the weekend? Yes, I am. The Scouser on the McDonald's drive through just what happened there? Yeah, there is. Yeah. Well, it should be here because we ordered 45 minutes ago. He's in no hurry, is it? Do you know what I mean? Sorry. Excuse me, mate. Excuse me. Yeah, we're not happy with this. Hang on a minute. We've had four customers served before us. We're not having this. Get on to them, Freddie. I'm just wondering where the order is. There's been four cars served before us. We didn't order much. Cheers, mate. That's how you do with that. I think I know why the food's late. Do you want to tell us what happened in this? There's a scouse, lad. There's a girl. There's a lady. What? <laughs> a lady. Tell us what happened there. So I said, you're watching the final of the weekend. You know, to Newcastle. He goes, no, I'm a red. So I'm not a Liverpool fan. So I went, wee. Ooh. You're hard, showing off. And that's why our food's <laughs> taking so long, because he wants to give it the big one on the Adam McDonald's drive. Sorry, so. guys. You're not going to see this, mate. But he goes, go on, give her a bit, go on, give her a bit, give her a what? bit. What? That's what you do. You're a shit out. <laughs> go on, why don't you give it him, Freddy? I'll just sit here and watch and laugh. I will not do anything and I'll let you do it all. And that's what happens. <laughs> A few minutes later. Ten minutes has passed, still no food. No, he comes up to us. We Freddie he comes up to us. Oh, how much did you pay for your order? No, he didn't say no, no, he didn't say that. He come here thinking that we've not paid So now how much did you pay for your order? We go, well, I don't know, no one remembers how much you paid for your order, do you? He goes, have you got any verification? I to pull my bank out. That's yeah, his bank account out to prove that we've paid for a McDonald's breakfast. Are they trying to like what's going on here? It's a McDonald's breakfast. Not a it's not a Gucci bag. Do you know what I mean? Joke man. We've got the food. So that's Freddy's order. <laughs> <laughs> we got double sausage and egg with muffin, and I've got four extra hash browns to be fair, but I don't care. Hash browns are the one. Right, we're packed up. We're on the way to the train station. We're going looking, seeing if scenes we've got any prime. We've got that new case. I want to have there. I really want to try it, but I love prime. Yeah, there was no prime, uh, but I didn't want any anyway, so. Yeah, yeah, his ticket's yeah, just not loading. I've got my, my tickets That's either. Sad. Um, have you got an email to prove, like, a bit of oh, I've got this. confirmation of it? Yeah. Want to... Cheers, thank, thank you. you. E-bag, gobby. <laughs> I feel like I remember on my own. We are at the train station. Next stop, W.H. Smith. I don't know what you can and cannot take onto a train. You can't sell C4s in a show. He takes it onto a train. <laughs> what, anything? Yeah. Even... It's just not a bomb. Right, we're on the train, as you can see. He's got a football manager installed on his iPad. I've got coverage to see. And I've got the Walking Dead to watch. It's only a two hour train, so it's not even that bad, to be honest. Two hour train journey, you know what that means? Bit of raft cross. We're at the train stop, the shop, let's see what they've got. No teasers, Kalo, some porridge there. Naked. How much? One porridge. <laughs> Blimey, mate, that's a lot. Hummus and cranberry, £3.99. How much for a bag of crisp? £1.30. Graze, £1.90. They won't be getting any custom from me, I can assure you. Cheaper to get the ticket for Wembley. We are arriving, the train is coming to an end, and as you can see, we've got a fantastic view of London. Right, we're off the train now. Our next stop will be the hotel, but we'll vlog along the way, see what happens. It's absolutely jam-packed. So they say London's busy. 
They're not lying, I'll tell you that. To be fair, I've seen it busy when I came, when I was at the Norwich game. I mean, we won't talk about the Norwich game, actually. Don't play in the clip, Lewis. <laughs> um, said uh, Barrow saying in chat, Corey, he's left-footed. Oh, oh, chance! Amenya! Clear on goal! He's done it! There's a pharmacy. So he's going to buy some paracetamol for the fun of it. Just like take 20 tonight. <laughs> <laughs> He's born to play in red and white. So listen close, it must be said. Like Manchester, Rashford is red. Right, we are in the underground. Oh my god, you know, like, you see them trams in like Tokyo and stuff like, around. This is London. Didn't expect this. Be sure we're on the right one. This will go to a transit. We'll end up at Arsenal. You okay? <laughs> Well, that's the tube journey done. We've got off at some place called Embankment. I don't like this, to be honest. Manchester is by far clear. Manchester's welcoming, you know. Everyone's together this. You can't even get a smile back. Stay with me to the platform. Welcome to London. He's scaring me already. In. We're outside, we've got a four minute walk to the hotel. Entrance to the Kit Kat Club. I won't be joining that club. Oh, we do <laughs> take a break. Nigerian flag there, thought we were in London. And ladies and gentlemen, this is our premiere in for the night. It looks very, very fancy. This is very suave. This is a theatre, I think. This is a theatre? Yeah. Mirrors all around. 250 quid. We <laughs> touch the best. We'll explain in a minute. He just know. had to put a deposit down. She didn't tell him how much. She said Apple Pay will be okay. He scans it, he then goes, how much? He goes, 250 euro. 250 pounds. We're not moving. We're not moving. The lift broke. Oh, I know it's a suave place, but we just it's, it's give us a normal elevator. How do you run the elevator? Oh, oh, that's what it's for. Look at the doors. Look at the doors. Open sesame. Jesus Christ. What a lovely room. Just open someone's room. Oh, you've not. That's a connecting room. What do you mean it's a connecting room? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not having someone walk in while I'm sleeping. <laughs> what do you What's in here? Look at that. They're like £4.50 a pop in Trafford Centre. If this is touchscreen, I'm going to lose my mind. Someone missed the seat. Oh, Fred here. He's got it on the floor. He's got it on the floor. Oh, right, this is miles better. The lighting's brilliant. We've got a TV there. Marble table here, just in case me and Freddie want to play a game of Snap later on. Bed there. Oh, quite comfy, actually. Here we are. Marble. Is this, I, I, I hope this is a shower. This is a funny looking bath. Oh, lovely shower. Wardrobe. Oh, we've got robes. We've got robes and a spanker. Right, Freddie seems to think this is a fridge, but I don't. Oh, dear guest, we would like to inform you that this is a cooling drawer. Therefore, there is something that you need to be refrigerated. Please contact our front office too. Glasses of water. How much reckon they are, Pop? I don't know, but you just broke the seals. Thought we were like 900 quid. <laughs> what? No. Open sideways, Freddie. Oh my god. All right, Mr. Freddie, Neo, and I, oh. we're out. We're off out. We're exploring London. Where are we going? Yeah, uh, really. I think we might go to, uh, to Nike Gymshark, maybe. Yeah, Nike and Gymshark, we're exploring. We've literally just came out of the hotel and we've got protesters out. I don't know what they're protesting, but the, the protesting summer. It'll probably be something to do with food, animals, or something. I, I don't know. I'm trying to work out what they're protesting. So we join in and start shouting United. What are you protesting about? Um, the mayor wants to bring in £12.50 a day in charge. What? If you've got an old car, like me. Right. And your emissions. Oh, because of the the air. Yeah. So the mayor's just trying to get more money out of you. Yeah, they want to extend it out to Harrow and Arkbridge. Oh, okay. Manchester, it's free down there. Yeah. Well, haven't they brought in something in? Yeah, they're doing something to do with Manchester. Yeah. Ooh, Lamborghini there. Yeah. Cheers anyway, thank you. Yeah, thank you. There's some Newcastle fans over there, by the way. We're jumping up. I've got a feeling London's just going to be full of Newcastle and United fans. I'm all for it as well. I'm all for it. <laughs> You're winning nothing tomorrow. United are winning. United. United. When I lose, I couldn't give a yeah, no. That's the spirit. Oh, Tanagi special, in it. I want a good game. I don't want a 4 0. I don't think he's going to score or celebrate, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a dumb better since he got rid of Ronaldo. Ronaldo, Pogba, and Lingon. Got three all over there, another protest. I mean, this is, I don't even know what to say, to be honest. We're about to walk through the, the, the parade. I don't even know what flag that is. This is more hostile than City yeah, United, this. Absolutely no idea what is going on. It's Iran. I thought it was the Iran flag. I'm just not gonna comment on any of this in case I cancel myself. Just come across a, sh a shop called um, Smeg. I am on the Call of Duty map. That sniper up there. 
It's always get you. You have the buses that are normally over there. Underground's over there. You spawn in over there. Oh my god. Jesus, just leaving Curry's now. The SD card got full halfway through. I'm absolutely fuming. We fixed a problem. We're now back out on the London streets. We are off tonight. I'm gonna get myself a football top. Really? What football top? I'm gonna get the grey PSG with mess on the back. He's got the PSG kit on now. To be fair, I thought it twice at you when I saw you this morning. I thought it was killing Mbappe. <laughs> One thing as well, I must say, you've got to be like a genuine, like a holding midfielder in London. You've got to check your shoulders at all times. Like, it's mad. There's just everywhere bikes, cars, taxis, anything, buses. And also, another thing I want to pick up on, we've seen about oh, oh, 200, so 200, so 200 so Newcastle United fans. Fun, United, fun. United fan? Get in. Oh, no, it's not. It's Mo Salah. We are literally the only United fans we've seen so far. And it's scary. We're in the Nike store. We've got their own DJ. Let's have a look at some of the recent victims. Oh, who do we see here? FC Barcelona. Done, dusted. Been there. Wore the t shirt. Oh, my God, that's gorgeous. Get it, Isn't it, Mo Ann? You know. How inappropriate is that? I probably tried the top on but didn't end up actually buying it. He bottled it at the end of the day, didn't you? Yeah. Right, on the way to Jim Shark, we've seen on cloud. Never been in an on cloud store before. So here we are, we're entering it. I don't know if they're gonna let me fit. Well, cute to get it. Cute to get it on cloud. From the outside, I was looking at these, but when you get closer, they don't really seem that nice. Very nice. I like the orange ones. £100 for a pair of tracky bottoms. Great top, sir. Great thank top. you, thank you. We're winning tomorrow, mate. Don't worry about that. <laughs> yeah, on cloud has gone down in my rating after that shop because that is an absolute sh show. I'm excited for Jim Shack now. Here we are. I said we got to get some tweet and see what it's like on the way back because I'm sorry. I can't, I'll just go online, do you know what I mean? We're currently in the Adidas store. I'm just getting a hat because my head is absolutely freezing. And then we're going to get some scran. Here comes to Adidas, I want some. Do you know what I mean? I don't think my want them. She'd rather have sketches. Here's an all longer freezing hat purchase. Now we're getting some scran. Let's say 30 seconds around the corner. Patty and bun. And that's where we're having our scran. I'm worried, but the menu paper is actually terrible. The phone is actually better. They've got six impossible chicken nuggets. I'm not sure what that means. Chips and rosemary salt. Not bad to be fair. I'm going to get some coleslaw. Scran has arrived. Chicken there. Uh, burger there, I'll show you that in a minute. Chips. We've got some rosemary sauce. Never had it before. It's actually really nice. Look at that bad boy. Oh, look at that. That is beautiful. Probably not the same as well. You liking the chicken? <laughs> Freddie loved the chicken, so I'll give it a bad. It's got chilies on, so I don't, I don't really want the chilies. Right, that. Right, I've finished. That was absolutely brilliant. It was, obviously. What are you rating out of 10? I don't know what to write, an 8. An 8 out of 10. I'm going to rate that a 9 out of 10. The chips were perfect. The burger was brilliant. The chicken was a bit... I liked it, but... And yeah, that's the weird twang to it. Ultimately, the food is a 9 out of 10. We're now going to go to where? Palace. Not Crystal. It was called Patty and Bun. Solid. Absolutely solid. Where's Palace now? End of the road and then left and then right and then left. Yeah, no worries. Hi guys, it's Freddy here. And today... We're in London, we're in the streets of Soho. We've discovered today that London, they have no urgency. People just stop in the middle of the road. Don't think, they just stop. We're at Curry's, everyone's just dawdling about. No, we aren't dawdlers in Manchester. Northern people aren't dawdlers. I'm a very urgent person. I don't like waiting, I'm not a waiter. No, I'm a doer. I like to just do it, get it done. Come the camera over to the I want to go quicker. Morgan actually hit the nail on the head before and said, it's like, it's like I'm Fred and Sabitzer in the pivot. Yeah, Always it is. Your shoulder. You have to check your shoulder. We're at the shop I wanted to go to. Simply pleasure. Eat, sleep, lube, repeat. It is warm and it is lovely in Palace. I've never even heard of this, mate, by the way. This is old Fredder. Say what I am seeing, though. £58 for a lighter. <laughs> £34 for the water bottle. Some of the things in London you can buy for the prices are extortionate. How's your touch? <laughs> It's like watching a real life on today. We are finally at Jim Shark. Just want to see what they've got. Why are you videoing me? Sorry. Why are you videoing me? I didn't mean to, sorry. Mama, there. What's the name of the owner? Jim Shark. Phil. Phil. No, Phil. Phil's the middle name. Phil's the middle name. American guy that owns Jim Shark. Yeah, I'm American, so dog. Phil me crash. And he's not a Man United fan. The person who owns Jim Shark doesn't support you, Man United. He does, because I actually no. own Jim Shark. I thought you guys just left. No, we don't lose, mate. We don't lose. I thought United just lost. He does. <laughs> Big Barcelona. Who are you playing today? No, no we're tomorrow. playing tomorrow, Newcastle. Have you heard of Newcastle? Oh, they're going to beat you, they're they? <laughs> No, they're not. Whoa, oh, hello. Right, sports bras. What are you doing? I think this will fit me. <laughs> Oh, he's found a bottle bottle. 12 pound, not 34, like oh, Palace. I'm gonna get that. I don't sound like this, empty hangers. Right, we're out Jim Shark now. I can't, I can't, I can't oh, here we go. you paid, as you are the owner. I'll show you what I got when I got back to the hotel. Freddie's got some stuff as well. We're now picking up his AC Milan shirt. AC Milan, I've got a new sign in. We won't tell him who yet, 
but they've got a new sign in. Right, we're done in um, Puma now. We'll show you the, the new sign in when we get to the hotel. Gonna drop our bags off, then go and find a pub for the Liverpool and Palace game. Come on, Palace. The Call of Duty map is back. 30 echo on me. <laughs> I don't remember him being in one of our fair. He must be one of the f***ing map packs. I don't remember him being here. United! Do you say anything at all, or is that it? No, say United! United! Stand still if United are the best team in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from? I love you guess. Oh. oh. I don't want to cancel myself. Well man, you guess it on first. What, Romania? Oh wow, very nice. Thank I'm you. from Manchester. Do you like my accent? Uh, it's it. super hard to understand it for me. Fair enough, I rate it. Please write my name in the book of life. That when I die, I will be with you in heaven. Amen. Oh, it's kicking off in London here. We've just been ganged up on by about 15 Geordies. I've had to just f nut them all. Really bad, really bad. Where's it telling us to go? Like we're playing Pokemon Go here. Eh? I'll get the lure down, get the lure down. Newcastle United. Newcastle, yeah. Newcastle what score? 1-0. Who scores? 1-0. Who scores? Almiron. Almiron. Fair enough, fair enough. Thank you for United as well, Yeah, mate. thank you for playing for us, mate. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. Eh? Yeah. So a bit, mate. Martin Dubrovka. We're intruding. Oh wow, we are. I'm wearing a United hoodie in the middle of all the Newcastle United fans. Look at them all. This is technically a fan zone. They've just, uh, just made, turned off. Just made it. A fan zone. Zone. Yeah, because we've been looking for United fans. I haven't seen one. Yeah, <laughs> so we've not seen one. All Newcastle fans. Yeah. yeah. Coffee, Saint Maxi man. No, head down as well. Don't start eating. It's Saint Maxi man. No, but. What do you mean? Don't start. It's Saint Maxi. Yeah. We are behind enemy lines here. This was a protest about Iran or something. It's now the Newcastle United zone. All oh, Newcastle United. <laughs> Just been told to f off by a Newcastle fan. Cheers, mate. <laughs> It's great to see, to be fair, for Newcastle, I rate it, I rate it highly. I think we're straight. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone else to get out of here? <laughs> I'm all for interviewing people for the score predictions, but I'm not going in front of all them thousands. This is the Newcastle United, and I'm talking over the whole of the, the, the people, everyone going Wembley. Look at all them. To be fair, no one's given any shit. Yeah, well, I've just been told to f off. <laughs> this is mad. If this was Sitter, me and Freddie would be f bank by now. <laughs> mad to see we've just seen Martin Dubravka, though. F no. Oh my f God, it's like an episode of The Walking Dead. Just take a minute to take it in. <laughs> this is remarkable. Absolutely thousands. The camera's not picking it up as much. I mean, we're talking, look at all that. Just goes and goes and goes. I'm looking forward to the final now. The atmosphere is going to be absolutely incredible. It will be immense. Can you give me a second chance to swap me under? I wouldn't do it. United through and through. Jordy boys on a bender there, giving me the middle finger, talking about Greenwood. I'm not even joking when I say this, it's genuinely like an episode of The Walking Dead. But we've got to get through it to get to the game tomorrow. I think we've got through it safely. Shade, man. Yeah. 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 You know what it is? Anywhere to be seen. You know what the players have? The first one you've ever that. seen. Score prediction for tomorrow? Um, I reckon 2-1 you Who scores for you? Uh, yeah, Isaac like is play. Okay. Okay. We just seen Dubravka down there. He said 1 0 Almiron. I hope so. I hope so. Oh, fingers so. crossed. Here we go. We're safe now. Yeah. We are absolutely behind enemy lines. Will we survive? You'll have to watch tomorrow's vlog. I'm going to end this one here. Thank you very, guys, very much for watching. If you're new, subscribe, leave a like, and then hopefully there'll be a vlog up tomorrow and we survive the night and we take the Carabao Cup home. The Au revoir. Tomorrow night are going to be unbelievable if we win.